What's up, everybody? My name is Zach, and today I'm here with my good friend Joe of the What's tennis up, team. Everybody? So, uh, my first question with you today is how is the transition from Division Two to Division One for tennis? For tennis, for us in particular, it was pretty difficult. Uh, we were sort of at the bottom of our division, of our conference, as it was in D2. So, making that jump to D1 in just less than a year and during COVID, that was that was difficult. Um, we worked hard, we, we gave it all we had, and for most of us, we were, for the guys that were my age, we were coming, we came in as D2 recruits, some of us walk-ons. So it was a big gap seeing some of the best players in the country <laughs> versus some of us local guys. So then, uh, how did you get into tennis? Like, I don't, tennis isn't really like a big televised sport, so how do you get into why don't you play tennis and stuff? So most people, it's it's very uh, centralized in cities. Mm -hmm. So it's pretty popular in Louisville with the local high schools and uh, just the clubs that we have around here. Um, I'm from Southern Indiana where it's still pretty popular. Uh, it's close enough to Louisville to where you can have a lot of players, uh, have a lot of court time. I got into it because my best friend at the time was playing in seventh grade and my baseball league ended, so I decided to pick tennis up, and I, I liked it a lot, and it was fun to work hard at and improve over the years. Nice. So what's your, uh, what's your favorite thing about tennis, like playing and stuff like that? My favorite thing about tennis is the competing aspect. Whether you win or lose, it's fun to compete, whether that be at practice or running sprints, anything. And we did that every single day here at Bellarmine. So that's that's the most fun part. It's not bad. So do you guys, do you grunt, do the males grunt when they spike or no, it's just like the females? You know what I'm talking uh, about? Like You'll hear some noises out here okay. with us playing at practice. <laughs> uh, the, the matches will probably have more grunts in them, whether it be men or women. It's it's a part of the sport for sure. Okay. <laughs> I always, th I think it's so funny when people do it. But, um, so how fast is like a average serve? Like I, those things, the ball flies and like while I'm watching it, like how fast does that go? For the pro tour, an average serve, they can, as fast as they can get, they can get up to like 130 <laughs> miles per hour. Oh uh, average first serve is probably somewhere between 115, 120. It, Cause you're trying to make it. They're not trying to bomb every serve, hopefully. Um, for us, for, for me in particular, I don't have a huge serve. It's more like get it in and get the point started. Um, so I'm probably somewhere between 80 and 90 on a first serve. It's um, still pretty fast. <laughs> and then the good, like we got some players that can crack one on our team though. They can get in the triple digits for sure. <laughs> Damn. So now I'm gonna try, since he said how fast it was, I'm gonna try and see if I can return a couple serves of Joe's, see if I, you know, got that. D1 tennis skill in me. <laughs> All right. Okay, give me one more. That's insane. So as you can see, it turns out I can't do it. But thanks for watching, guys. I'll talk to you next week. <laughs>